when I tell you. Kicking and screaming, kicking and screaming, trying to get the show. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Larry, and I'm back again with another video. All right, y'all. So I am so excited for this video because y'all, y'all know how Yeezy had basically like their last Yeezy day, and we was kicking and screaming, kicking and screaming, trying to get the shoes. So as you can see. We got three boxes right here because I got three pair of shoes. So, what I originally got was I got a pair of uh, foam runners, I got a pair of 450s, and I got a pair of 350s. I was trying to get certain colorways, but I didn't end up getting those um, because they beat me to the punch. And then I wanted a pair of blacks. But by the time that I got by the time that I got on there, the freaking drawing was already closed. I was so mad when I seen that. I was like, girl, because I was at rank four. I was at level four. And you know the rank system, the higher you are, the more likely you are to like win. So I didn't get the pirate blacks and I didn't get the utility blacks, which I was trying to get. So <laughs> just trying to tell y'all this. Just so y'all don't get no false hope because. But yeah. Not me switching moves automatically, like real fast like that. But yeah, and I also got my Neiman Marcus bag right here because I got some heavy hitters that I'm gonna show y'all what I got from when I went with my dad. <laughs> I just wanna put y'all on when I show y'all. But yeah, y'all, let's get into it. Let me show y'all what I got. These are the 450s. I got these in a size 12. Um, I just followed what the website said. If it says size up, I size up. If it size down, I size down. So first impression. My box don't seem tore up because a lot of people have been saying that they should have been coming moldy in the wrong size. So, oh, look at that. Made in Germany. Wow, this is the first one that I've seen like this. What? My shoes have never been like that. Made in Germany. Ooh. They call these the cloud shoes. They're interesting. Let me see what they look on the foot. Look at that. They feel soft. Really switching my, my lighting up. I love you. But yeah, so look. These ones I got. I hope y'all get to see, like, because I can't really see, like, that that much. Um, but, yeah, as you can see, it's, like, a lighter gray in the back. And then it's dark gray. The bottom is gray. It's, like, a full gray moment. They're a little hefty. They feel comfortable, gummy, really soft. I'm just happy that they're not molded. But these are the Yeezy 450s. What color is this? Stoke tea. That's the color Stoke tea. Screaming. We got them in the color Stoke tea. This one's too packaging. My other one wasn't packaged like that. Okay, period. <laughs> I'm happy about these because I have a pair. Um, the all white or stone. I won those in a raffle on Yeezy.com. When Yeezy.com was a thing, girl, was a ting. I got these in 11 and a half. Because that's the size that I had my last one, my other ones in. These are just like, like this. I don't know why the other ones that made them gummy, but these don't. Period. This is what I came for. Look at these. These are so comfortable. Look at that. Black and white. They call these the pandas. Look at the bottom. It's so gummy. Bottom part. Focus. Hey, and like right here, this is the best part of the shoe for me. Right here, this middle part, it's like a memory foam pillow and it puts pressure on the top of your foot. It feels so good, it's like so comfortable. So like, when you put your foot in there, it's extra comfy. Top tier. And I got these in 11 and a half. 
bottom clean. You see the boost. You see the boost. You see the boost. There's those. Yum hide because I like these. I like the 350. 350. Oh, 350 knits. The pandas. Like, the crazy thing about it is, I've been waiting for these shoes for a while now. And those last ones, the knits, they didn't even send me confirmation saying that they haven't shipped. So I had just so happened to look at the box. And it was like, oh. And I'm like, okay, I guess. Because I've been waiting on this, like I said in my last video, so I can do this. And these are phone runners. Got them in size 12. Cause I want to size up. I use I wear eleven and a half, so I rather size up than size down. I don't know about this colorway. I really wish I would have got the um, what was it, sandstone or clay something, the red clay or something like that. That one would have been more bearable for me because I'm a neutral person. But these, I feel like I got these because nobody else really wanted them. But I mean, you could wear a lot with this. I didn't know it had brown in it. So look at these. I like the brown and gray part, but this blue part is what is going to be hard for me. This blue part is what is going to be hard for me because I don't really wear blue like that. Like, but me, I have a whole bunch of neutrals, so I could just wear neutrals with this. And these are in a size 12. These are kind of cute. They smell like my other ones. They five five cute. Second pair of phone runners. I have an all black pair, and now I have these. Cute. Okay. Big curve, not the little one. And you know, you got the phone runner. You got this thing. Oh, phone right there and then runner down here. R and R. What's this colorway called? I don't even know what this colorway is called. I don't know, blue and blue and gray. I think. Oh, it's right here. It's an MX C and D R. Okay. That's probably what the rest of them are like. Put on the inside. Y'all gonna hide because I am, okay. I'm a little bummed that I didn't get all the ones that I really wanted to get. But like at least I got something. At least I got the cloud shoes. I got the farm runners. And I got the knits. The knit. I like. The, I wanted the knits, and I wanted the foam runners. But I wanted the utility blacks, and I wanted the pirate blacks. But I'm kind of glad I didn't get the pirate blacks because right now a lot of people are saying it just came in moody, and I'm just like not in the mood. Yeah, for that. But those. That's what I got for Yeezy Day. The last Yeezy Day, y'all. The last Yeezy Day. Now I'm gonna show y'all what I got from Neiman Marcus. Oh well, all of this isn't from Neiman Marcus, but. Y'all know the MFK. Y'all know the MFK. And y'all know I'll be smelling good. So I'm gonna put y'all on and show y'all what I got uh, when I went. And then show y'all some other stuff that I got as well. So I've been on, I've been on Mason Francis uh, Kardashian. Kirk, Kirk John, Kirk John, Kirk, Kirk, Kirk the John, Kirk the John Paris. I've been on him bad. I got the uh, the Aqua Celestius. That one smells so good. Drop down boots. It's like a floor. It's like a uh, a citrus a citrus uh, juicy smell. So good. But she gave me a test of this one, the 724. When I tell you, so good. When it dries down, it smells like. I don't even know. But let me show y'all. The packaging. Period. I didn't get the big size because, like, girl, if you look at this size, it's already kind of big. And then look at the background. It's like the city. Period. 724 is that girl. This is heavy metal. All right, y'all. Switch it. So I'm like, I guess because my freaking camera died. So, 
love that for me. But as I was saying, 724. I don't know. It just smells so good. It has a, like a light floral smell. Then when it dries down, it gives like a musky, clean smell. Ugh. Smells so good. Y'all gotta go try this. At least go to Neiman Marcus or your perfume store and smell it. it smells so good. I've been fiending, fiending to get this one because when I got the tester, I don't tell you I was spraying that thing down. Man, that just smells so good. Crack. And then I was like, I was there and I was like, oh, I wanna get two because I mean, might as well, you're already here. And I got the Amiris Home smell. I wanted something that was stackable but wearable. So this one, it got the gold on the top. It's the name right there. What did it say? Natural Spray. It's a perfume made in France. They both are perfumes. This one's like gunmetal gray on the top. This one's heavy as well. As well. <laughs> I'm so dead. And then the top. Mm. This one is like a little florally. Imagine like cool water, but more floral and more of a light scent. This one smells so good. And on the skin, it gives everything. It gives life. Mm. I just feel like when you spray it on, it smells good. But then when it dries, when these scents dry, they smell so freaking good. And this one's just like see-through. Smells so good. And I got both of these in the 1.2 fluid ounce. I didn't really want to get the big one in plus. I think the big ones are like 200 or something. I mean, which I don't have a problem spending that much. It's just like, I feel like the 1.2 is enough. I don't need that big bottle. And the big, the big one is not even that much bigger. So, girl, who are you really fooling? So good. It smells so good. It smells so good. It's like a floral smell, but it's fresh and light. It smells so good. And then I had to get my good old standby bra. This come on right here, the Vince Camuto Solar. When I tell you, this is a sexy smell. This is a sexy smell. Imagine like uh, a warm, sultry, not warm and sultry, but warm, what is it? Sweet, kind of like chocolatey smell a little bit. And then it has a, a little freshness at the end. <sighs> this one smells so sexy. Mm. Let me spray it on top. Oh my gosh. <sighs> this is what the bottle looks like. All right. It's like a, like a manly, caramely, glazed type of smell. Ugh, that was it, that was it, that one's it, girl. I had to get a refill because when I bought that, I had to use it up, so I had to get another one. I rarely have to get re-ups on colognes because I don't really, I mean, you know, girl, I'm lying now because I do use cologne kind of a lot now. And then this one, I haven't even opened this yet, but at the place that I got the, uh, the risk middle from, they had like buy one, get one, like, I don't remember how much it was. I think it was like $16 or something like that. Something like that. I think it was $9.99 to be honest. And this was one of the ones that I could get. I'm not trying to get the, to the toilet no more. Cause I just feel like stop wasting my time. Even though the DaVinci Camuto was a toilet. That thing is thangin'. That thing smells so good. But this is what the box looks like. This is Aqua Essence Da. I don't know, girl. Honestly, I don't even remember what it smelled like. Couldn't even tell you. 
It kind of looked like Dior, the Dior bottle. Oh, this is backward. Let me show on the back side. This is definitely like a fresh spice smell. With a little bit of coconut and some citrus. Fresh, what did I say? Fresh coconut citrus. I definitely smell cedarwood. Mm, this one smells good too. What the heck? Yeah, that gives, that eats. That's what I got. I just wanted to show y'all the smells, the recent pickups. Got these. Boom. Four colognes. These are heavy hitters. These are heavy hitters too, but these, they, they in a whole other level. I appreciate y'all showing the love and support on my videos, subscribing. Uh, make sure y'all sharing the videos, liking the videos, commenting on the videos. I love interacting with y'all. Um, and yeah, I will be posting more videos. Thank y'all so much. Like, comment, subscribe, show your boy some love. And peace out. Get some of these sprays, girl. It smells good.